today I am going out and looking for some fall decor um, to spruce up my home. And this is a challenge that Hillary from um, Old World Home puts on. And this is the fall edition. So there will be um, a playlist down below. So if you want to check out the other videos, make sure you go and check them out. But I'm going to go into my first store and I hope I find something that sparks joy for me and I hope you enjoy. So I forgot to mention that our budget is $5 so we need to find something that is $5 or less to spruce up your home for the fall. And they have some cute items here. Let's see how much they are. pretty challenging. I had to go to several different stores and um, a lot of the stores around where we live are more of like um, boutiques, secondhand stores, not thrift stores. So things seemed to be a little pricey. Um, but I did find two items and they were at two different stores that I went to. Um, so I'm going to share with you what I got. So I found this at the second store that I went to. Um, I paid 50 cents for it. I know you can buy this at like the Dollar Tree or like um, Target and stuff, but I was just desperate to find stuff and I had so much fun decorating around my front door with cobwebs that I decided to pick this up and for 50 cents I was saving some. But what really draw, drew me to this is that it comes with four spiders. So I just think that's going to make it really cool. The cobwebs that I bought earlier this year didn't come with spiders and I was actually thinking of going to the Dollar Tree and picking up some plastic spiders to put in it. But this one came with spiders. So for 50 cents I was like I'm going to pick this up. 
I think this is super cute and I can decorate inside with it. So picked up some bag of cobwebs and then I picked up my next items. They were all at the same store. Um, I picked these up for um, $2 for the three of them. I think they're really cute um, and not a bad price. Um, I don't know. I thought it was a little pricey, but I thought it was in my budget and they are cute. I'm not sure exactly what I'll be doing with them. They're all the same, but they, yep, they're all exactly the same. No different faces. Um, but they're just little wooden pumpkins, um, scary pumpkins with a little house. I think they're really cute. Even if you just displayed them like something like this, or maybe if you tied them to something, um, I do think they're cute. And for two bucks, it was within the budget. So I think with these two items, I will be able to um, spookify an area of my house. Um, so I'm happy with the purchases that I got. And thank you so much, Hillary, for um, inviting us to do this challenge. I look forward to it every season. So it was a lot of fun. Now to decorating. I really enjoyed this challenge and I'm so happy with my spooky mantle so far. I also have a ton of that spiderweb stuff still left over so I can spookify a little bit more of my house. Thank you so much Hillary from Old World Home for doing this challenge again. I really enjoyed. Hope you have a great Halloween.